Okay, everybody, meet Caleb on the left, little Lou, and Miss Jillian on the right. Uh, Caleb is about 13 pounds and around three years old. And Miss Jillian, the little terrier mix, she is probably, oh, 13, 14 pounds and one to two years old. And they have been in foster care because they were special cases and Charlie and Sydney took them into their home to try to work with them and get them comfortable. Uh, Caleb seems to do really well. I mean, he's doing better, I should say. He's made progress. Jillian is a little slower to make progress with people. Um, they are dogs that get along well with all the other dogs in their home. Play groups that we've had here at the rescue, they get along just fine. People, they are just, they're not fans of people. So they would need a home that is fine with them not being cuddle buddies or lap dogs, things like that. They'll sleep on the bed with them, um, but they don't want to be, you know, cuddled up next to them. And they love each other very much. They play, they wrestle. They're like an old married couple. So we're going to try and get them adopted together just because they, uh, they kind of thrive on each other. They are not the best on slip leads or things like that. So they would need, need to stay in a confined area at first until they got comfortable keep their leashes on. I think he looks a little more relaxed. <laughs> He's starting to fall asleep. Jillian is just very tense. For She came from a hoarding situation, so we don't know her background of why she's fearful of people. We can only imagine what some of these dogs go through. So uh, if, you're, if you're kind and patient and, and want a little activity in your home and don't mind that um, she's not going to come up to you to have her belly rubbed or anything. You know, she loves treats. She'll take treats from Sydney and Charlie's hand, um, but she's not one to jump up in their laps and, and sh you know, shower with kisses and all that. They've come a very long way, though, since we first got them. We've had them for a while. We've just been trying to see when they turn the corner. And uh, like I said, Caleb seems to do have made a lot more improvement than I expected when I met, uh, got to see him again today. Jillian, uh, she's improved a little to where she, you know, you, Sydney and Charlie can pick her up and uh, all that. She just doesn't, you can tell, she doesn't enjoy being loved on <laughs> for whatever reason. But they like to wrestle on their couch. They like to do dog things and be around. Um, they're very good in their crate. They go potty out in their yard and they come right in and go back in their crate. So um, they're very compliant. So Caleb and Jillian are available for adoption. If you're interested in them, you can apply for them online at tracysdogs.com. Please make sure you can pick them up at our next transport destination before you submit an application. Once you're approved for them, and if you feel that you're the right home and we feel that you're also the right home, um, we will load them up and send them your way. Poor little food. Caleb is very relaxed. He's taking a little snooze. Jillian is a little more uh, cautious. She's a beautiful girl, though. Those are our lovebirds. 